Steve Oliphant here. I'm going to show you how to make an image or a link clickable in HTML. Now I have Notepad open here and I'm just going to type some HTML code in it. If we do A, which stands for anchor, href equals, right here we can put, and we usually have to put it in quotes, although, well, we should put it in quotes, you don't have to. We can put the link that we want people to go to right there. And then whatever we put after that close tag is going to be clickable. This can be an image, it can be some text, um, it could be whatever. Now we have to close the A tag. You close an a, a HTML tag using that slash. And now we have a clickable link that says go YouTube. Let's make it say go to YouTube. Now let's make one that's an image. Um, in HTML, the white space in the source code does not matter. Uh, if I actually want this to, sh to leave some spaces between that link and this image I'm going to put in, I have to put in some more HTML code. A P stands for paragraph. I could have also done a couple of BRs, which stands for line breaks. Um, and then let's see, ahref equals, I'll show you that you don't have to have the quotes here. Google.com. Now here's an interesting thing. The image, the source of an image, oh, that wouldn't have worked got to do HTTP colon slash slash. Now, if I'm going to put an image here, I can do image source equals and then quotes, close quotes, like that. Now, that's nothing's going to show up, um, except for maybe if I put in some alternative text, which is just for if images are not there. Anyway, we can go out and find an image anywhere on the web. Any image that you show has to be on the web. It's usually in the same site that's showing the image, but in this case, I'm going to go just kind of borrow one from Google itself. Um, this is Google with the alternative text. That's what you see if the image doesn't load. Now let's go find out what our image source is going to be. I'm going to go to Google itself and steal their main logo. Let's go to Google.com. Uh, let's see, right here is the image. We'll copy, let's see, we want to go to properties actually. And that is the address. And that's what we want to copy. So I'm clicking to highlight that. I'll right click and do copy. And then we'll close this. Okay. Close that. And we'll go back to our thing here. We'll insert. Oh, I missed. I'll do it right there in the image source. We'll insert it there. Now let's save this out and look at it, and you'll see what I mean. We do need to save it as a .htm or a .html. Let's save it on the root of the C drive so we can find it easily. And instead of a text document, we need to do, well, let's do all files. Let's go to the C disk. And then let's call this test.html. Now, if we, so test.html is the name of it. If we go and we open that up in our browser, and we can do this with file colon slash slash ctest.html, and you have to spell it right or it doesn't work. And there we go. And that's a link that takes us to YouTube. Click on that, we go to YouTube, Let's go back, and this is the link that takes us to Google. And that's how you make a hyperlink in HTML.